Welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Hello, friends. Welcome back. Problem one dash thirty five. So in this problem, it is given that if a turnbuckle is subjected to an axial force of 900 pound, determine the average normal stress developed in section AA and each of bolt shank at B and C. Each bolt shank has a diameter of 0.5 inch. So you can see this is a bolt shank clear. This is bolt shank B and C having diameter 0.5 inch. The load P is given 900 pound. So you have to find the normal stress, average normal stress at section AA and at this shanks of the board. So what you have to find is that sigma section AA clear, sigma A dash A. You have to find the stress in board B R C. This A uh, uh, stress in shank at point B and C will be same. So sigma B is equal to sigma B and you have to find this. So first we will start uh, for finding this load P. So if you uh, want to find this load P or stress uh, force at section A, so you have to cut it along section A. So when you cut a long section A, so the diagram or the free wire diagram will be like this. I will try to draw it. So it will be at this point. So this is the bolt here is applied clear so this was section a a a a so when you cut this section so definitely here the normal load will be equal to n a a and also here which is equal to uh, n a a clear you will find uh, this n a a P is given that is equal to 900 pound so first you will find this normal force along this uh, section AA so for we will for that we will apply the equilibrium condition that sum of all force along x direction is equal to 0 and taking the force in direction is positive so you can see P is positive direction so it will be 900 and these two are in negative direction so minus 2 times n AA their sum must be equal to 0. So it means that NAA 2 times NAA is equal to 900 pounds and this NAA will be equal to 900 divided by 2 which is equal to 450 pound. This is load NAA. Now we have this NAA so we can find the stress at uh, in section AA. So stress in section AA is equal to normal force which is NAA divided by area. Clear? So you can see here the portion the cross sectional area is given so it is 1 inch width and thickness is 0 0.25. So the area will be equal to 1 into 0 0.25 inch. So it will be equal to 0 0.25 square inch. So this is the area, this this is the area. So I will write down the value 450 divided by 0 0.25 clear and that will be equal to 1800 pound per square inch which is PSI. Or you can also write sigma AA is equal to 1.80 KS. So the first part we have calculated the value of first part which is the sigma AA. Now we will we'll find the stress at point B which is the sh bolt shank clear. So for that we have to cut this uh, bolt over here. So I will draw the 
which is the normal load P and here the load will be equal to NB. Clear? So, from our equation of equilibrium that sum of all force along x direction is equal to zero and taking the force in this direction is positive. So it is clear that minus P plus NB is equal to zero. So it means that NB is equal to P which is equal to 900 pound. Now you have this force clear and you can find the stress sigma V is equal to NB which is normal force divided by the area of this ball chain. So area since it is circular I will put the value 900 pounds since the ball shank is circular and its diameter is also mentioned 0 0.5 inch square. So you can put in the formula 5 by 4 into 0 0.5 whole square. Now when you calculate this so you will get the value which is equal to 4584 psi or you can say that sigma b is equal to 4.58 ksi so this is the answer of part d and since sigma b is equal to sigma c so that sigma b and sigma c is equal to 4.58 ksi i hope you have enjoyed the video thank you for watching and keep supporting me like this